The Princess of Wales paid a visit to Hillingdon's Colham Manor Children's Centre. Kate chose a ripped dark blue knit midi dress from Mango and a button-down cashmere wool coat from Hobbs for this essential visit. She accessorized with dark green court shoes and a chimichu clutch, both of which she has been seen wearing previously. At the Colham Manor Children's Centre, she met and talked with a three-year-old kid. When the princess knelt down to speak with the boy, she was delicate. The boy inquired as heard her name. My name is Catherine. Pleased to meet you, the princess said with a smile. When the princess observed the youngster staring at her red poppy pinned on her chest, she inquired, Do you have your poppy? It's well known. Do you want one? You can have mine. Let me try to pull it out. The princess explained the importance of the poppy while struggling to remove the flower pinned to her shirt. Do you know what this is for? A princess asked the boy. It honors all soldiers who perished in the war. This is for you. Please, would you look after it carefully? After giving the boy the pin, the princess turned to meet the boy's mother and sister. The image of Princess Catherine instantly went viral on social media. She has received amazing compliments from friends. Because of her incredible bond with children, fans have dubbed her Children's Princess. Catherine's so wonderful, compassionate girl. She's my one and only children princess. Catherine is amazing. The youngster next to her always feel close and comfortable. Her warmth is transfers onto every child. Following her visit to Holham Manor Children's Center, the princess went to the Modern Mental Health Alliance (MNHA), a facility that assists all women experiencing perinatal mental health concerns. He spoke with the most vulnerable mothers in their communities on the impact of these and future opportunities. He has always been supportive of breaking the stigma surrounding mental health and supporting those in need. He also spoke with representative from agencies working in perinatal services in Hillingdon, including psychiatrists, midwives, health visitors, and social workers, and engaged into a roundable discussion convened by the MMHA. The purpose of this tour is to demonstrate the life-changing impact of an integrated, multidisciplinary system of care for families dealing with perinatal mental health concerns. It has long been dedicated to eradicating the stigma around mental illness and assisting those in need. She has also gained a better grasp of the early years and the significance of a child's first five years in their development during the last decade. As a result, she is dedicated to giving new parents the assistance they require to properly welcome and support infant into the family.